welcome students let us see a very interesting and important question from the chapter ratio and proportion here question is divide rupees 1870 in three parts such that half of the first part one third of the second part and one sixth of the third part are equal question is very important so a total amount given is rupees 1870 and we have to divide it into three parts such that half of the first part half of the first part one third of the second part and one sixth of the third part are equal we have to find out all the three parts of rupees 1870 which satisfy this condition okay so let us see the solution here so let us suppose that let x y and z be three parts of rupees 1870 correct it means that is x plus y plus z is equal to 1870 let us write it relation number one now let us apply the condition what is the condition half of the first part so we can write here according to the equation according to the question what is question here half of the first part means x by 2 one third of the second part means y by 3 and one sixth of the third part z by 6 are equal these ratios are equal and let us suppose this is equal to k we are supposing it so in terms of k we can write values of x y and z therefore x is equal to 2k y is equal to 3k and z is equal to by cross multiplication only z is equal to 6k now by relation number one here we are getting x plus y plus z is equal to 1870 so we can put these values x y z is equal to 2k 3k and 6k respectively so we can write here x means 2k plus y is 3k and plus z is 6k is equal to 1870 and therefore 2 and 3 5 and 6 11 therefore 11k is equal to 1870 and therefore k is equal to 1870 divided by 11 and this is equal to 11 manja 11 11 7 ja 77 and 0 so we are getting here k is equal to 170 now we can find out values of x y and z which are required here we can get it very easily so therefore x is equal to 2k means 2 into 170 means 340 y means second part is equal to how much 3k is equal to 3 into 170 and this is equal to 510 and third part z is equal to how much 6k 6k means 6 into 170 and this is equal to 1020 okay so these are the three parts which are divided according to this condition three parts of 1870 so we can these are the answers so these are in rupees these are rupees three parts of 1870 now we can check the answer here how we can check total should be 1870 so you get the total of these three numbers 
1,020. We are getting here. How much? Same. 1,870. So these answers are correct. So three parts of rupees 1870 which is required is rupees 340 second part is rupees 510 and rupees 1020 is third part so we can use this condition also and we can check that this condition will be set, uh, satisfied here so x by 2 will be how much yes 170 similarly y by 3 is equal to 510 by 3 that is 170 and z by 6 that will be this much by 6 is equal to 170 correct so these are the answer these are three parts of amount total amount 1870 question is simple but important questions so such type of questions are asked in different competitive exams so I will advise you to do some practices of this type of questions so that you would have a good command over this type of questions from the topic ratio and proportion. Students, I hope you might have subscribed this channel. If not, please get it subscribed and share these videos with your friends also. And if you are really getting benefit, you are enjoying learning mathematics here, learning as a fun. Okay. So your likes are most welcome here. Thank you very much. All the best.